Today, Kevin and I have some giant, <laughs> the size of a baby's head muffins for you. <laughs> Um, at least the cat's head. Uh, these uh, these are both the same company from what I could find on the internet. However, different names. This one is Fernando's Bakery and it is the Gourmet Strawberry Cheese Muffin. And then Kevin has American Classic uh, Gourmet Blueberry Muffin and... Banana Walnut Muffin. So I'm gonna go ahead and open these and then I'm gonna talk to you um, give you any information that you need to know. We are going to try these heated and unheated because I know that if I don't, I'm gonna hear from somebody. Hey, you didn't heat those up. You didn't heat it up. Wonder how it was heated up. Okay, so, they're good size muffins. They're huge, huge. So I'll show you what it looks like. Should I just cut it in half? Yeah, cut it in half. And leave half on the plate and put half on uh, the paper. Okay. This is very pretty, very pink, and then... There's the blueberry. Blueberry, you cannot see one thing on the inside. <laughs> no blueberries. You, the blue, wow. you blueberry, you saw one here, Yeah. and you saw one on the like outside, but there's absolutely nothing on the inside. Do you know what this banana smells good? Okay. And banana. 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 Yeah, it does smell really good. Mm -hmm. mm, gosh, that smells good. There's nothing to see there. Yeah, so I'm going to heat these up for I don't know, 20 seconds or so. It doesn't say on here to heat them up, but we're going to anyway. Uh, yeah, the banana smells. I don't know how it's going to taste, but it smells like a uh, candy banana. It smells, uh, I don't know. It, well, no, it, it, it's a cross between candy and um, I want to say real, real banana, fresh banana. Um, these were only a dollar at Dollar Tree. Uh, I had never seen these in Dollar Tree before, and now they have like a whole section, uh, mainly um, American Classic, I think is what all the other ones are called. I think this is the only one that was called Fernando's Bakery. Uh, so I don't know why the gourmet strawberry cheese muffin kept retained that name, but it did. If you eat the, well, I, Kevin finished earlier than I thought. Let's try the banana first. Why don't we? Because you were talking slow. I wasn't talking <laughs> slow. I didn't, well, I didn't think I was talking slow. Okay, so this is banana walnut. Mm -hmm. And th it's this one. So you want to try heated or cold first? Oh, I forgot we had cold too. That's so. We have to try it unheated first, don't we? Yeah. I'm giving you a sliver because. Oh, yeah. Because it's huge. I don't want to eat three fourths of a muffin here. I like that. Not bad. The texture is, um, I don't know. You don't like it? I don't know if I like it or not. We have some in, so it'd be noisy. Mm -hmm. I like it better heated. Has it too. And I think it has. I think it has a good banana flavor. It, it's an okay flavor for me. It's not. Once it's not it top settles, one, it changes a little bit. Yeah. Once it settles in your mouth, it does. What would you say that flavor is? Once know. it settles, kind of a. It's different, isn't off it? Off flavor. It does. It, yeah. it tastes like it's like it's going bad. Yeah, Once I like. It, I like the smell of it, but then I don't like it actually taste. And the, the texture is a little, I don't know, it's not grainy, but it's its chunky. I don't know. <laughs> I like the smell of it. I like the taste, The I like the texture of it. And I like the flavor when I first put it in my mouth. I really do. And I like it heated better. Mm -hmm. So if you have time to heat it, I would heat it. But I don't like... I wonder if it's the walnut that's leaving that out. Maybe. It could be the walnut. Walnut because walnut really doesn't stand out when you're first eating it. So I'm wondering if maybe that's kind of the... The lingering flavor, maybe. But the banana flavor mm. itself is really good. Okay, this is blueberry unheated. I didn't get any blueberry whatsoever. Mm. No, 
Just I tastes mean, like a muffin. None. None. Zero. Zip. Oh no, there is a blueberry sitting right there. So if you get that, of course it's good. Of course you're going to be able to taste it. I don't care about getting the blueberry. No, I'm going to give it to you. I don't care about the blueberry. So in other words, you don't want it. You go ahead and eat. I think we should half it. Yeah. There. Yeah. That way we're actually getting blueberry. It didn't. I still didn't get blueberry at all. Um, and you still get that. I still have that aftertaste. I wonder if it's the muffin itself that has that. I didn't yeah, get the aftertaste. aftertaste. I didn't get the aftertaste that time. I don't mind it as a plain muffin. That is not a blueberry muffin. It's not very muffin. sweet though. I do not believe they should be able to call that. If they're all like that, then they shouldn't be able to call it a blueberry muffin. No, it literally has because, like two or three blueberries in the whole Yeah, thing. if you pick that up, I mean, and that's half of it, there's nothing there. Forgot to tell you, the banana nut for the entire muffin is 550 calories. For the blueberry <laughs> muffin, it is 540 calories. And for the one we're getting ready to do, the strawberry cheese is 540. Wow. For the entire muffin. Yeah, and they're big muffin. The serving size is half. So yeah. you're, they don't in, intend for you to eat. Well, I pulled that one apart and there was only one more blueberry in there. So you're literally talking about three blueberries. They shouldn't the call thing. that blueberry. I don't think that's fair. That's, that's not a fair name for that. Okay, this is strawberry. Strawberry cheese or something like that. Yeah. I don't know what a strawberry cheese is. That's kind of weird. I really don't get a strawberry flavor. Mm -mm. No, I don't get Again, I get that aftertaste. I don't know what that taste is that's, that's hitting me. It's not hitting you. Maybe I just got used to it after the banana. Yeah, uh, it after could be. I don't know. I don't taste strawberry at all in that, by no, the way. No, I not. mean, at all. It's the color of strawberry. It, it might be pink, but... Okay. Mm, so good. Heated on a scale of 1 to 100, I got like maybe 0.5% strawberry. Yeah, I didn't. I mean, no, you may as well say nothing. Now, these are kind of a dead. Yeah. I, I didn't really like any of them. The, I didn't get the aftertaste with the strawberry ones. So that's a no, good no. At I least not heated up as much. No. Um, I think it's better, you're just better off going and getting one of the really big name uh, muffins, paying a little bit more for them, probably not a lot We've more. We've reviewed some more. before on this channel and they've been delicious. Yeah. And they're they're big muffins too. And I, the flavors of those and the quality of those is so, so much better than these. Yes. These are, these are, these taste like a cheap muffin. Although a dollar a piece is really not all that cheap because I'm thinking that other brand was probably a dollar fifty. I mean, I know, really I wasn't too they, much I don't more. Think so, that much more. So you get. You're just thinking as, about the ones at Walgreens. Yeah, yeah, and you're getting just as big a muffin, um, with but well, much better quality. Um, I'll just, uh, I can say it. I don't mind saying it. Uh, Otis Spunkmeyer. That's yeah. what we're talking about. Those are good. The ones. Otis Spunkmeyer, and I reviewed them on the channel. If you want to see them, uh, they're he, they're just as big as these, and they have the flavor to back them up. Yeah. So you may pay a little bit more. I don't remember how much we paid, but they're very well worth it. These, if I was if I was gonna go in and I I was gonna pick one though, and I had to pick one, I would pick the blueberry because it's just plain. It's just a muffin. It's plain. It doesn't taste like anything. It, to me, it didn't have an aftertaste. It just tasted plain. The the banana, like I said, it was it was good when I first put it in my mouth, but then once something once it settles in, it's not that great. Um, and the strawberry, I don't think they should be able to call that strawberry cheese. I don't know where in the world that name's coming from. Uh, just them dying, putting that pink color doesn't mean it's going to taste like strawberry. No. I don't know who is tasting these and telling them this has a strawberry flavor because, um, somebody that has dead taste buds, because that does not taste like no strawberry. Color. Uh, so yeah, the, the blueberry muffin's not bad. Like you said, it's, very it's not plain. bad, but it, it shouldn't be called blueberry. No, no, no. That's it's just very plain. It's not sweet at all. I don't think any of these are really sweet. Um, yeah, it's just 
It's just bread. Yeah, it's more <laughs> of just bread and not something sweet yeah. like a muffin, like we expect a right. muffin like this should be. Yeah. So I would avoid these. I'd just go spend the good money on. Yeah, I'm things. sorry. We tried. Um, or get the mini bites at, at Walmart. You know, they're they're a hundred times if better. If you've tried these, let us know what you got. I would really like to know. And if you love them, if if you do. Leave it in the comment. I would like to know which one is your favorite. If you have a favorite, if you've tried them and you feel the same way, let us know. And thanks for watching.